Oh yeah. Oh yeah, guys. This is so cool. This is so cool, guys. What's up guys, me like here, and today we are back in action playing some Astrid Nier. And last time, a lot of you guys actually gave me a lot of really helpful things. Uh, first of all, like the rover, you can actually build multiple rovers, or I guess multiple trucks, or maybe you can attach a rover to a truck, I'm not really sure. And uh, apparently you can form like a train. So if you want more storage, you just build more rovers and attach them to each other, which I think is really awesome. Also, a lot of you guys told me I can just shift click. So like this guy, for example, I can shift click, it automatically goes to my back backpack and then I think someone said if you double click it'll automatically go to different sections of the base like if I need copper here actually let's um here let's grab some copper no it's aluminum okay that's fine let's come over here and then let's say we wanted to build I don't know if this is working I'm trying this out for the first time here like a truck we need aluminum right so let's go ahead and open this up and then I think double click or shift click no I'm not sure actually someone said you can like double click it and it automatically goes to the correct area or something I don't know, guys. I'm actually not really sure. Uh, but there's something you can actually... Oh, yeah, you can just click on that. Okay, I see. So you can just directly click on these little things. You don't need to drag it from your backpack or whatever. That's awesome. Uh, I'm not sure what someone said about double-clicking. I'll have to, like, re-look at that. Anyways, what I want to do is, before we start today, is I want to actually open up these guys. Also... Uh, someone told me that if you've already researched something like this guy right here, uh, like let's shift click that. Yeah. Okay. If you've already researched something uh, like I've already researched all these, then uh, you actually get, uh, I think, titanium or lithium, which I think is pretty cool. So this is actually an easy way to get uh, some rare research or rare resources. Uh, let's go ahead and do this last one right here. I need to start looking up or uh, looking for some more stuff because I definitely want some more blueprints. Is this not attaching or is that attaching? I don't know. It looks like it's almost not attaching actually, which is kind of strange. Anyways, I think this one's new. Yeah, this one's new. So we should get some new items here. So we got a winch. Okay, so. Oh, that's really cool. Dude, this game keeps surprising me with the amount of features it actually has. This is so cool. So a winch. So we can actually winch things out of. I'm assuming you can stick it to a vehicle and then like use a winch on another vehicle or something. Or maybe if you want to drag objects. Oh my god, I wonder if you can winch um, the researchable things. That would be so cool, guys. That would be awesome. Anyways, let's go ahead and I'm going to look at, let's see, shuttle, truck, spaceship, rover, truck. Okay, and then let's look right here to see if the winch is right here. I'm still not sure. <laughs> that just got completely flipped off. That's funny. Uh, let's, uh, can I stick here? Yeah, I'll stick you right there. Uh, drill head. We definitely want to make a drill head, so we need some copper. Uh, battery. We do need a battery, though, as well. Some lithium. Actually, we have plenty of lithium now. We can go ahead and make a battery. Or should we be saving our lithium? We might want to be saving our lithium. Generator. Habitat. Okay. 1C. Winch. Okay, so there's a winch right there. We need two things of titanium. Um, I think we actually have plenty of titanium over here. Uh, yeah, this is, that's aluminum, that's titanium. Yeah, that's titanium right there. Let's go ahead, I'm gonna make a winch. It might not necessarily be something that we actually need right now, but I'm gonna go ahead and make this. Boom! We shall make it and it shall happen. Uh, and I also wanna make a truck. So for a truck, we need four things of aluminum. I'm pretty sure we have, yeah, we have two aluminum, so I need to actually go mining. We need to get the rest of the aluminum needed for this right here. Also, I realized I could've just clicked on that or whatever. Um, actually, I wonder, here, let's stick this guy, like, I'm trying to think of where it can we can we can we get this like from any part of the base like for example if I needed that and I clicked on this no it doesn't grab from every part of the base it actually has to be directly on you so my backpack is full for example I'm gonna drop the resin right there I'm gonna shift click that it's gonna go no yeah it's gonna go directly in my backpack and then I'm gonna click on that it's go, gonna go from my backpack to that okay so that definitely makes things uh, a little bit easier I'm glad you guys told me uh, let's go ahead and put that right there so we actually have a full thing of fuel uh, we just need to make some more Anyways, guys, I'm going to go get some more aluminum. Uh, we're going to make the truck, and then I guess we're going to use the winch on the truck. Let's actually put... Can we stick this, like, to right, right there? Or does it need... It needs to go on the back, right? Okay. I'm actually kind of curious... Oh, God. I can't stick this anywhere now. <laughs> uh, can I stick this, like, right up here? Get, no. You're not... Fine. You'll just, you're just going to stay right there. I hope you don't disappear. Uh, I wonder if we can stick the rover and attach it to the back of the truck. I don't know, guys. I'm not sure. Also, this is one of the thrusters I found. There's actually another one in uh, one of the cave systems down there. I'm not sure what thrusters are for. I'm assuming spaceships. 
And then someone also said that uh, you can use the oxygen ore and then the power ore. I already knew all about that. Um, so, yeah, that's pretty cool. Actually, you know what I've decided we should do, guys? Instead of stay here, because I just went to the cave and there are world holes everywhere. I think we need to go to a new planet. Hopefully, I think the issues are still going to be present on a new planet. Uh, but at least, hopefully, it won't be as bad as this one, I'm guessing. I don't know. I'm not really sure. Uh, what we can do, too, is we can start planning our base a little bit better now that I kind of know how the systems work. And, uh, yeah, I think that's just going to be a much better plan. Now I did, I am going to have to leave some resources behind, and we do have quite a bit of resources that are still here, uh, but we can just go ahead, let's just make the uh, the spaceship guys, we have enough copper, uh, I think so anyways, so let's go ahead, yeah someone said, oh yeah I just clicked that, yep, let's just, let's just click these guys, boom, and we have all of that, and uh, let us make the spaceship, hopefully it doesn't get messed up because of this thing. Yes, come on. I'm so excited guys, we have a spaceship, we can fly into space, and it's going to be amazing. Okay, so we have a spaceship, right? Uh, it is a little glitched up. Okay, so I think this is where we stick fuel. So I think we have to actually stick fuel directly on there. Yeah, and it actually just sucks up all the fuel, which is pretty good. Boom! And uh, now we need to figure out what we need to put on top of the spaceship here. Now, I saw before that you can actually... I think I saw in another video where you can actually stick things on top of this. Also, does this right here, since this has little side attachments, can I, like, stick the rover on this dude or something like what happens if i also this connects so i'm guessing this just like shares the base power right i don't know i'm not sure if you can actually attach things to this but we what we can do is we can make a new thing to make a base here so if i just go ahead and stick a let's see let's go ahead a habitat let's go ahead and make a habitat boom and then we can we also probably want a seat as well so maybe i'll actually take the seat off of this dude or maybe this has its own seat I'm not sure if it has its own seat. Can I stick a seat up here? It is a spaceship, so I'm not sure how well that's going to work. Let's go ahead and take the habitat. Let's stick the habitat up there. And do we need... Uh, see, I'm not sure if we need some sort of vehicle bay. Let's click that. Yeah, let's click the vehicle vehicle bay. I don't know. I need to figure out how to like attach stuff to this because I think it has like its own special seat, though. I'm not sure. Yeah, guys. So I, I figured it out. It finally started working here. So I'm going to go ahead and stick this guy right there. Uh, the crane or this little part uh, part of the vehicle bay, actually, you can make storage, a three-seater, a one-seater. Uh, let's take all this other stuff off of here. Yeah, let me take all this off of here. And then, oh, yeah, we can actually just straight up deploy that. We don't want to do that, though. We can stick a crane on here, too, which is interesting. I'm not sure what the crane is for. Maybe we can carry stuff with this. What do we need for the crane? We need four more pieces of copper. I'm not sure if we would use that, though. We got some storage. We got a three-seater, one-seater. So, yeah, this seems like uh, this seems like all you can make right now. We probably want... Hmm, I'm trying to figure out what would we want. We got storage. We, d we definitely only want a three-seater, right? So, let's go ahead and make... Uh, or a one-seater, I mean. Let's go ahead and make a one-seater. Okay. Um, what do we need to make this? We need compound. Well, luckily, we have millions of compound here. Can we make this? Yeah, let's go ahead and make a one-seater. Yeah, this is cool. I like this. So you definitely can't use that. I mean, I you might be able to. I got in it, and it said, ask me if I wanted to launch. But I'm assuming if you try to launch, it's either going to give you an error, you're going to die, or it's just going to be finicky and just work, I guess. <laughs> I don't know. One or, one, or the, uh, one or the other here. Are you going to, are you going to let me build some more stuff on top of you, man? Yes, possibly. Also, I filled up all the fuel. Okay, yeah, one seater. I'm not sure what else we should take, guys. Storage. Like, how big is this storage right there? Maybe we should just bring our own storage. Maybe we shouldn't even worry about that storage. Three seater, one seater, crane. I feel like the only other thing we could possibly build that's going to be beneficial to, to us is a crane. And I don't even know what we need a crane for. It just sounds cool, right? So... A spaceship with a crane just sounds awesome. Maybe, maybe if we take the crane, we can like bring something else with us. That's what I'm hoping. So maybe we'll try to do the crane. I think the crane needs, um, yeah, it needs uh, four pieces of copper. Yeah, we don't have any more copper. So I need to go actually get some more copper. Uh, but in the meantime, I think what, what I'm going to do is we're going to stick this storage right there. And then can we stick this on top of here possibly? Nah, see, that's going to take up space. We just don't have enough space on here to really do everything that we want to do. Oh, yeah, and we need to take this, too. See, <laughs> maybe we shouldn't do the crane. Maybe we should just take one thing of storage, our pod here, okay? Um, and then maybe we should take the solar, right? Or maybe we should do, say, screw the solar. 
and do two storage. See, <laughs> I just don't know, guys. Maybe we should just say screw. I mean, we can always come back, right? We can come back. So let's just uh, get all the resources we want to take with us, and let's just go. We can come back later. Okay, guys, we're back. So I have got everything. Everything is completely filled up here except for these two items, I guess. Um, I tried to stick another storage on top of this dude right here, but apparently that doesn't work. Um, so we have a solar panel. Uh, we have one, two, uh, six, ten units of storage on the thing. We have a C, and then I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven units of storage on me. So, and this guy is completely filled up with fuel. So I guess we're good. You know, I would say we should bring extra fuel with this. Uh, but the fuel thing's pretty easy to make, and it only requires power. So I think wherever we're going, we can set up, like, refuel stations along the way. And we can even set up, like, mi a mining colonies, now that I think about it. You know, if we find a planet that's, like, really rich, we'll just set up, like, a temporary mining colony. We can just transfer uh, resources back and forth. Now, I don't know if there's anything in the future that's going to allow us to make things like that a little bit easier. But, I mean, right now, we'd have to kind of do it manually, right? So, anyways, let's get on here. Yes, guys, so let's get a quick look around at our spaceship and this is everything we have with us I wish we could take more. Well, like I said, the space is here. We can always come back. Um, let's let's head out guys I'm very excited. Oh Yeah, oh Yeah, guys, this is so cool This is so cool guys This is so awesome, okay, let's zoom out um so we can actually pick any of these destinations on the planet and it seems like okay so let's hit this again oh okay so this is our solar system right here no maybe not a solar system because i don't see a sun or a, or a star actually no is that the star yeah it's a star right there um so we're here let's see there's a barren planet right here uh there's an arid planet um let's go over to the arid planet guys this is so cool this is so cool i'm so excited Yes, this is awesome. So, yeah, I guess this is the solar system. I'm not sure if it's possible to uh, be, uh, I guess, inner interstellar where we go to other stars. Or maybe even eventually, eventually intergalactic. That would be awesome. What type of planet is this? Does it say arid? Here, let's go back up into the... Yeah, this is arid. So, I guess that just means it's hot, right? Uh, maybe it doesn't... It's not barren, though. So, I'm not sure if we should go there. Where did we come from? I think we came from there, right? Yeah, we, because that has a little moon right there. Um, what's what's over here? What's right here? How do we how do we go to these other planets man? Uh, radiated Okay So can we not go to these other two do we have to wait until we're like into some sort of like synchronous orbit or something? What's down there? What is that? Wait, I don't understand what's down here uh, Anyways, let's go to the radiated planet So I don't know if we're gonna need any sort of protection if we go to the radiated planet and I don't know what we just went straight through that dude <laughs> that's a bunch of crap uh, so this is the radiated planet I'm not sure which one's the best for resources here we could come here um, let's here let's uh, let's look again hmm I'm just trying to find out I wonder how to I, I want to get to wait what's this exotic planet okay that sounds interesting and that looks like kind of like an exotic planet too actually let's head to the exotic planet so i, I guess we have to go to these in order kind of like which one or maybe maybe it does depend on the orbit i'm not sure we have to wait until the planets orbit close okay so that's the exotic planet guys this is so cool man uh now can we actually get to the other one now no we're even farther away so that's the only one we don't we don't have access to right now uh where are we Okay, yeah, I guess let's just go to let's just go to the exotic planet. It doesn't really matter where we go uh, We can pick any of these landing sites. Do we want to go to the blue areas or do we want to go to this area? This actually kind of looks like a pole a little bit just without being frozen, right? We go to where Here this is like partially No, okay. It's just loading in. I see it's just loading in. I thought it was like a different uh, Biome or something here. Let's just go here Oh god, look at our fuel, guys. We're already, like, halfway. Uh, so yeah, this is completely awesome, man. This is completely awesome. I like this a lot. So, I wonder if this... Oh, dude, everything's green! Oh, everything... Wait, is everything screwed up? I feel like... Dude, this is so cool! This is so awesome, man. Uh, let's go ahead and get out of here. Dude, this is so cool. This is amazing. I love this a lot. 
Uh, I keep taking pictures. So, let's see what's on this planet here. Um... Is this... This is so weird. We definitely eventually want to explore all the plants. I'm guessing uh, the game is only a solar system right now. I guess this is a cave right here. Oh my god, we have like a thin layer of dirt above us unless... Yeah, we just have a thin... Oh, copper! Right here! We got copper right here. Okay, so it's storming. Let's head back. Uh, it looks like... Oh, that's so cool. It has surface copper. That's awesome. So this might be like the copper planet. Okay. Oh, God. Oh, God. Let's... Oh, God. Get it. Get inside. Get inside. No. No, please. For, here. For love of God, just set it down. Yeah, boom. Okay, it's launched. We launched it. We didn't know if we wanted to launch it here yet or not, but we needed to get inside. So hopefully this planet doesn't have a lot of storms all the time, or this is going to be bad news. Uh, we also might want to move our spaceship. I feel like this is bad that I set this down here. I shouldn't have set this down here, guys. Yeah, this is bad that I set it down here. Um, I'm going to see if I can figure some stuff out real quick. Okay, guys, so I have extended this out pretty far here. We have one, two, three, four, and then we can also branch off any of these directions right here. So we're going to have like a more structured base this time. Also, I'm very excited about all this uh, Malachi slash copper laying around everywhere. Uh, first thing we probably want to do is a smelter and a new fuel source or a, new, or a new way to make fuel. Also, we need to... Oh, God, is that... That's Malachi right there. Uh, let's go ahead and get our solar panel here. I'm going to stick this right there. Yeah, so our whole base should be getting power now, I hope, possibly. And we should also be getting power from the base, maybe, possibly. Okay, well, I accidentally just now stuck this out here. Let's go ahead and stick the solar panel on here. I guess that's fine. Uh, it's not quite as straight as I want it to be. I accidentally clicked on the little thing that said resin right there. So we need to go mine some resin because we need a lot of it for this. And then I guess what once what we'll do after that is I'll start building up the base here. And if I find anything super interesting, uh, I'll show you guys. Okay, guys, we're back. So I have gathered some resin and uh, some compound. And I was actually really worried. I couldn't find resin at all. I was worried that this planet had zero resin whatsoever. But appears, it appears that uh, the planet has plenty of resin, which is good. So the first things we need to make is we need to make a smelter, we need to make a researcher, and we need to make a vehicle bay. Because since the terrain on this planet is so weird, I've built like several bridges down from here. I should have actually built the base like down closer to the ground. But I was kind of uh, panicking and in a rush, so I screwed it up slightly. Anyways, let's go ahead and put these resins right here. Yeah, so I think first thing we want to build is probably a research. Yeah, so for this, we need compound. Well, luckily, I'm pretty sure we have a compound. We got some right there. Uh, let's go ahead and grab that. I'm not sure if this is going to be enough. Uh, I'm not... Well, what I mean to say is I don't, I'm not sure if we have enough. Uh, looks like we don't. So I, I definitely need to go get some more compound. But we have lots of copper. We have a lot of copper laying around. So we definitely need a smelter at some point as well. Uh, let's see. What do we need for a smelter? And also, research we need compound. Smelter we need compound. So, it looks like I'm going to have to go get about five more compound, and then we're going to build all three of those things. Okay, guys. So, I haven't found all the compound yet, but we definitely have enough to make a research table. I've also found uh, hematite, which is iron. I'm not sure what you use that for yet, but it's very interesting. I haven't seen iron yet, so that's pretty cool. Let's go ahead and make the research table, and then I guess let's make the smelter? Or maybe we should make the 3D printer. I'm not sure. Maybe the smelter. Smelter is probably going to be good. Uh, let's go ahead and put compound right here. I know I can press that thing. I keep forgetting. And then we definitely need some more resin. We need some more resin so we can build that. Uh, but we have the smelter, which is awesome. Let's go ahead and stick uh, some malachite on top of here so it doesn't blow away. We, re we had a storm last night, and it kind of blew everything around like crazy. Uh, let's stick that guy right there. Uh, and then do we... Oh, yeah. This isn't hooked up, right? Or no, this is hooked up. Hmm, let's stick that right there. Okay, so nothing has power. I guess we're going to have to wait till daytime. Uh, and we definitely need to start getting some storage. I was hoping to be able to research some stuff. Actually, let's go ahead and stick this guy here. Uh, I definitely want to be able to research things. So this planet definitely has different resources. We found iron pretty easily. Uh, copper seems to be pretty uh, seems to be everywhere. And I think uh, there's actually a special resource over here that I didn't mention to you guys. Uh, I didn't know what it was. Oh, uh, dude, this copper is like way over here. Holy crap. Let's uh, let's just stick this guy like right there for right now. Hmm, let's stick this one right here as well. Yeah, dude, look at all of this copper. We have so much copper. We probably want to stick up our hematite as well. Yeah, let's go ahead and stick this guy right there. 
Uh, and then, actually, we can... No, we have the compound. We don't have the resin, though. We definitely need to make some resin. So I'm going to wait till daytime. I'm going to look for some more resin, and then we're going to try to research all this. We have one, two, three, four, five, six things to research, and I think there's something else down here. And most of these are new, so I'm hoping we actually get a lot out of this. Okay, give daddy some new research. That's what I'm talking about. We're going to go ahead and research all these. I haven't found any more, uh, I guess, resin or whatever. So let's see what we get. Hopefully, please be new stuff. Something brand new, baby. Brand new. That's what I'm talking. What do we get? It didn't, it didn't tell me what I got, did it? I seriously did not see what we got. Um, did we get something? Or do we know everything already? I swear to God, it didn't say anything at the bottom. So, I don't know. Yeah, these are definitely new things because it's giving me research. Huh. Let's see. Nothing. Both of those things gave me nothing. Huh, that is so strange, guys. So, can I not, like, learn anything anymore? Let's go ahead and stick that guy right there. Okay, let's learn this. Boom, yes. And then let's bring these guys all the way up here. I was hoping... To, oh, lithium. Okay, I'll take that. I'll take that all day. Uh, let's uh, let's stick that guy right there. Um, and yeah, I, I was really hoping to get some new research, man. But maybe that's not possible. Maybe we know everything. I was kind of hoping we were only barely scraping the surface, to be honest. Okay, let's just give it a try. Let's just keep trying to see if, um, maybe it's just not showing me. Oh, uh, titanium. Okay, I'll take that. Hell yeah. I'll take that all day. Um, yeah, so I would guess we've already researched some of these guys. Titanium. Oh, yeah, I need a titanium for something, didn't I? Uh, I have power, or I have battery. Okay, so let's go ahead and research this guy right here. Please give me something good. Give me something real good. What is that? Uh, nothing. So I guess we know everything, guys. I think, right? Is that is that what that means? You're gonna have to tell me because I have no idea. Uh, it just gives me nothing every time, unless we're just like rolling. See, I, I don't I don't think we can actually get the same thing multiple times. So we would just have to be extremely unlucky if that was the case. Yeah. Well, at least we're getting titanium and stuff, so that's always good. Also, I got a spare. I just made a spare oxygen thing. I'm gonna go ahead and stick it like down here. Yeah. Actually, I'm gonna stick it over here. There we go. So we got plenty of oxygen, which is good. Boom. Last research for today. Give daddy something good, baby. Something good, please. Please give me some new research. That's what I need. That's what I want to see. Okay, nothing. Okay, so I guess we can't unlock anything else. We've already fully unlocked everything. What I'm going to do is I'm just going to stick, I guess, the solar panel here. And, uh, yeah. And we'll just start smelting all this stuff down. Actually, I want to smelt, uh, let's smelt some of this hematite here. I'm very curious to see what it's going to give us. Which I know it's going to give us iron, but... We don't have any yet, so I'm just curious to see if it's going to give us anything special. Okay, or, you know, that's fine. You know, that's perfectly all right. Okay, guys, so I have went and got a bunch of freaking resin here. Uh, let's go ahead and stick that guy right there. So I have everything kind of planned out. Of course, this isn't all the machines, but we're going to put a printer right here. Uh, I can go ahead and make the printer. And then we are going to stick a vehicle station right there. So we need some aluminum. And then I'm going to stick a fuel condenser here. So we need copper. We definitely have enough copper. Let's go ahead and just hit the put the copper right here. Let's make the fuel condenser. And then, yeah, I don't think we have the aluminum. I'm not sure. We actually might have the aluminum over here. And then I'm going to actually make a trade station right here. Yeah, trade station. Is this it? Pretty sure this is it. Yeah, trade platform. So we need aluminum for this as well. Let's see. Is this... Um See, I'm not sure if we have... Okay, there's one piece of aluminum right there. And then I think this is also... Yeah, that's aluminum as well. So we haven't made the trade, uh, trade platform. So I don't know how well this is or how good this is. I'm not sure how you trade or how it works. Okay, compound. Okay. So this gives... Wait, what is this? What do we... Batter... Oh, wait, 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 wait. That is interesting. So resin organic so we can actually i think we can actually straight up get the stuff we want laterite malachite aluminum copper hydrazine lithium coal titanium compound by the way i found coal earlier um which is pretty cool resin organic okay so this is all the stuff right here awesome so if we need anything like for example if i need aluminum right uh it, it would be laterite so i don't know what we need to trade for that this is titanium, so what if I stuck that there? So, okay, so for one titanium, we can get two yields of laterite. That's pretty cool, actually. Okay, since we have a bunch of copper, what do we get for that? So it's it's one, 
it's one copper per thing we have a bunch of copper so let's go ahead and trade here um see so yeah, that that's malachite here let's uh let's go ahead and stick that there i'm gonna stick this over here i'm gonna stick that right there let's go ahead and smelt this down baby that's what i'm talking about uh anyway so this is good everything here is good we definitely need to start doing some power um Okay, so we got this guy right there, and then we got this guy right there. Let's go ahead and trade. I definitely want to get as much aluminum as possible. I, I Except for, I guess we only need really two aluminum. Uh, we're going to stick... No, that's a battery. I, I don't know. Stick all this back on. I want to do that right there. Okay, so we can get two laterite. Let's go ahead and do it. Perfect. So, oh, that's so cool. So it ships it off. Oh, that is so cool, guys. And I'm assuming we'll get our shipment here pretty soon. Uh, unless they just rob us. Are they going to rob us? <laughs> They're just going to straight up rob us, bro. The space pirates, the space gangsters have uh, stolen our goods. I'm sure we'll get that back at some point. I kind of want to see it come back, though. I wonder how long it takes. Maybe it takes like a day? That actually might make it worth, like, building several trade depots. Like, oh, no, here it comes. Oh, here it goes. Nice. That's so cool. Okay, so let's go ahead and grab the ladder, right? Nope. Dang it, dude. No, dang it. Okay. Yeah, grab the ladder, right? Yes. Okay. And then uh, we'll smelt this down. And we'll have, so I, I can't smelt the iron down. I'm not sure why. It seems kind of weird for some reason. Okay, so we got that. Uh, we got some more resin, which we can use to build over here. Actually, I guess what I'll do is I'm going to go ahead and stick the resin right there. Uh, it's going to turn into a platform. Perfect. Oh, no, I screwed that up, didn't I? I think I screwed this up. Well, we can build off this way. That's fine. Uh, so yeah, we've done everything uh, except for aluminum, I guess. Uh, I'm pretty sure we have maybe some spare aluminum over here that's copper. Oh yeah, we got one right there. Oh yeah, we got two right here. Okay, sweet. Let's go and get both of those. And, and then let us build a uh, vehicle. Nice. Or a vehicle uh, bay. Awesome. So we pretty much got back to where we were in a single episode on, our, on the previous planet. And I'm assuming at some point, uh, we'll probably do this for all the planets. By the way, here's the coal. Yeah, we'll probably do this for all the planets at some point. So I think what I'm going to do, guys, is I'm going to go ahead and call it here. Hopefully you enjoyed. Next time, we will try to make the truck. And then we'll try to make maybe some rovers and drive around on this planet with, like, a big train sort of deal. And then see how cool it is. Also, another good thing about having a vehicle, which I forgot to mention last episode, is the vehicle gives you unlimited oxygen. So you can pretty much drive as far as you want and have oxygen forever. The only problem is obviously power. So, but if we do like a train, we can get like a couple solar panels in one of them and produce way more than enough energy or maybe a generator or whatever, you know what I mean. Uh, but yeah, I will see you guys in the next one.